Welcome to the 2021-2022 Open Enrollment Information Session. Um, open enrollment this year will be June 1st through June 30th, through, yeah, June, through June 30th. And we have with us some of our vendors um, as guests that will present information regarding health insurance. I will share information regarding the Delta Dental Standalone Plan. And then we have legal resources rep here. And then I will come back to talk a little bit about our flexible spending account. So let me again, welcome, introduce our guest. Um, I'm Lori Ann Smith, your benefits coordinator. And we also have with us, John Andre, our uh, director of HR and compliance. John, you just wanna say a few words before I move on? I do, thanks, Lori Ann. First of all, thanks to Gabriella and Cindy for participating today. And thanks for those who are listening in. These are very important considerations for you. Um, Lorianne does a wonderful job of bringing everybody together and providing her own perspective on things. So we hope that it's meaningful for you. And obviously, if you have any questions now, please ask them in the chat. And if things come up later on, please email Lorianne and um, we'll get the answers to you. Thank you, John. Also, we have with us um, Gabriella Hayes from Anthem. And Gabriella, with you wave. We will hear from Gabriella in a few more minutes. And then we also have Cindy. And Cindy, I honestly do not want to mess up your last name, but I have been practicing. So, Kolosinski. Perfect. <laughs> yes. So, Cindy is with us from Legal Resources. So, we will hear from those two ladies in just a bit. Um, before we go to Gabriella, we'll go to her first. I want to share my screen with you. So just be patient with me for just a second. And share. And there we are. So thank you, thank you, thank you. So again, welcome to the open enrollment information session. Um, the open enrollment, again, I would like to repeat is June 1st through June 30th. You um, will need to do any forms that you need to complete and or online information um, during this period, June 1st through June 30th. Of course, during open enrollment, um, we have four things that, that you can access and change. It would be your health insurance. So that's one. And I'll talk a little bit about that. Also, a dental, the standalone dental. And then we have the voluntary benefits or flexible benefits for your flexible spending accounts, the um, DCA and the FSA, the medical and the uh, dependent care. And then of course we have the option of legal resources as well. So you have those um, things that we would be doing during open enrollment. And I'm gonna stop sharing for a second. Um, in your packet, in your packet, you can see this, this is the red, you will get a red uh, packet. It has a red cover sheet and then other information about how to log into um, FSA for flexible spending and legal resources for um, to, to enroll. If you want to change, make any changes to your health insurance, all that information will be on the red sheet. So be sure that you look for that. That will be included with your contract in the contract envelope. So be sure to check your contract envelope for this packet that's bright red, can't miss it, um, with information on how to access forms, um, how to access benefits summary. And I do wanna go over that. So again, I'm gonna share my screen just so you can have that information for later. Um, I believe it's this one and share. Okay, so you're familiar with our WJCC website. Um, you go to here to employees. This is to access our forms, the enrollment forms for the local choice, information regarding how to um, get to the portal for legal resources, as well as a portal for flexible spending. Um, we'll also be there. You go to WJC Connect, and these instructions are on the red sheet that's included with your um, contract. And you're gonna go here to the, once you're in WJC Connect, go to Forms, top of the page. And to the left, you see payroll, excuse me, pay, leave and benefits. That's the easiest thing to do. Right here, 2021, 22, open enrollment information. And while everything is not there yet, you can see there's your TLC enrollment form. 
There's your benefit summaries for the high deductible, the 250, the 500. There's the personal data change if you just need to change an address or change a name. And then there's your flexible spending account um, information, um, the online FSA store, online enrollment portal. Let's see if it'll let me go back. Of course not. So let's go back to here. Um, and the legal resources, there are the two forms there. Again, the digital open enrollment um, form is there and there's a link in there. You can just click on that if you wanna enroll for legal resources. So I wanted to be sure to share in this presentation how to access the forms, the benefit summaries, the rate sheet information will be there. I do not have rates yet. We rates will be available at that spot that I just showed you, um, June 1, beginning of open enrollment. So at this time, I believe I have covered everything on my little checklist. I'm going to turn it over to Gabriella. And Gabriella, I'm going to pull up your presentation. So if you wanted to do any preliminary introductions while I do that. Thank you, Ms. Lorian. I am Gabriella Hayes, and I'm an Anthem account representative who works between your HR department and then the local choice benefits. So I represent the liaison between the group and the Anthem benefits. Um, I will be reviewing your benefits, which are administered on a plan year basis from October 1st, 2021 through September 30th, 2022. And it's very important to review your benefits every year to make sure that you're enrolled in the right plan to meet your changing needs. I'm going to review the highlights of your coverage. So please refer to your benefit summaries that Ms. Lorianne just showed you how to find um, for complete description of the benefits, exclusions, and limitations. Next slide, please. So there are no changes to your insurance carriers this year. Your medical, your behavioral health, your employee assistance program, your um, routine vision, and your prescription drug benefits are administered by Anthem Blue Cross and Blue Shield. Your preventive and comprehensive dental benefits are administered by Delta Dental. Next slide, please. So good news, there's only one change to your benefits this year. We've added a healthy sleep program to your Life Health Online list of services. And this program provides members with home sleep studies in a virtual environment where sleep specialists can diagnose sleep disorders and design treatment plans to improve sleep and overall health. With this slide, it talks about the access to providers. So you've got access to in-network coverage through the Anthem PPO network in Virginia and the Blue Card PPO and Blue Cross Blue Shield Global Core programs for care outside of Virginia. So you're covered no matter where you go. 95% of doctors and 96% of hospitals participate with the Blue Card PPO network across the country. So make sure you always show your Anthem ID card when you receive services. The PPO in a suitcase symbol that's on your ID card shows that you can get care from Blue Card PPO program providers. For care within Virginia or outside of Virginia around the United States, call member services at 1-800-552-2682 for assistance in finding a participating doctor or hospital. When you see a blue card program doctor or hospital, you pay only the usual plan deductible, coinsurance or co-payments, and the provider files the claim for you. For care outside of the country, call Blue Cross Blue Shield Global Core Services Center at 1-800-810-2583 for assistance in setting up doctor's visit or hospital stay. You will need to pay up front for care then fill out a Blue Cross Blue Shield Global Core claim form, send the form, receipts, and any bills that you have to the address that's on the form. To avoid higher costs, out-of-pocket costs, always check to be sure that the providers are in network. If you go to a doctor or hospital outside of the program, you'll need to pay the entire bill up front and then file your own claim. Next slide, please. It's very important to take care of yourself and your family. You have coverage for in-network preventive care without having to pay a co-payment, deductible, or co-insurance. 
Your routine wellness and preventive care services help to establish your baseline health status, focus on maintaining your health, or catching things early to treat them much easier. You have coverage for well child care for immunizations and screenings through age six, for routine wellness services for annual checkups once per plan year, ages seven and older, and then preventive care for annual things once per plan year, for example, your annual GYN, PAP test, mammogram, PSA tests, and colorectal cancer screenings once per plan year based on age and frequency guidance from the CDC. Next slide, please. The Key Advantage 250 and the Key Advantage 500 plans have a co-payment for services that are typically received in an office setting. A co-payment is a fixed amount that you pay at the time of service and the plan pays the rest. For example, on the Key Advantage 250 plan, an office visit with a primary care physician has a $20 co-payment per visit and an office visit with a specialist has a $35 co-payment. The high deductible health plan you'll notice is different because it is a deductible first plan. So you pay the allowable charge for all medical and pharmacy services until the deductible has been satisfied instead of paying co-payments. Most doctors and facilities will require you to pay a portion of the estimated costs at the time of services. Once you receive your explanation of benefits from Anthem, make sure to compare it to the invoice from the provider so that the amount owed is accurate. There are no referrals required for specialty care on any of the plans. Next slide, please. All three benefit plans have a plan year deductible, which is the amount that you pay for services before you pay coinsurance. Deductible amounts are calculated on an individual basis for each family member. For example, if you cover one person, you are responsible for satisfying the individual deductible only. If there are two people covered, each of you satisfies the individual deductible. And if you have a family that's covered, two or more people, Deductible amounts for each individual member accumulate toward the family deductible. However, no individual family member can contribute more than the single only deductible amount. In-network and out-of-network deductibles accumulate separately for the Key Advantage 250 and Key Advantage 500 plans. For example, the in-network deductible for one person on the Key Advantage 250 plan is $250 and for a family, it's 500. The in-network and out-of-network deductibles are combined on the high deductible health plan. So for one person, the deductible amount, regardless of in or out of network, is 2,800 for one person. And then for a family, which is two or more people, it would be 5,600. Next slide, please. All three benefit plans have coinsurance, which is your cost share after the deductible has been satisfied for the plan year. For in-network services on all three plans, the coinsurance is 20% after the deductible, which means you're paying 20%, Anthem is paying 80%. Next slide, please. So a few examples of the services that you would pay 20% for after meeting the deductible are diagnostic tests and x-rays, shots, those could be allergy or therapeutic injections, infusion services, therapy services, ambulance travel, medical equipment, appliances, applications, formulas, and supplies. Next slide, please. So an out-of-pocket limit is the maximum that you pay for covered services in a plan year. Once you reach that limit, you pay nothing for covered in-network medical, behavioral health services, and covered prescription drugs for the remainder of the year. In and out of network, out of pocket limits accumulate separately on all three plans. For example, the in network out of pocket maximum for one person on the Key Advantage 250 plan is 3,000, and for two or more people, it's 6,000. The in network out of pocket maximum for one person on the high deductible health plan is 5,000, and for two or more people, it's 10,000. Even though the high deductible health plan has higher out-of-pocket limits, it has a key advantage or a key feature that the Key Advantage 250 and 500 plans don't have. It's the only plan offered to you 
that the IRS deems qualified to pair with a health savings account. An HSA is a tax advantaged member owned account that lets you save pre-tax dollars for future qualified expenses, which are outlined in the IRS publication 502. The IRS sets limits each year for the maximum amount that you can contribute. For the 2021 plan year, the maximums are 3,600 for an individual and 7,200 for a family. If you are age 55 or older, you can put an extra $1,000 in contributions called catch-up contributions into that account per year. There is no use it or lose it rule. The money in your health savings account remains yours. Even if you retire or separate from Williamsburg James City County Schools, it's your money. IRS Publication 969 has a lot of helpful information about eligibility, contributions, and distributions from the health savings account. Next slide, please. I mentioned earlier that going out of network will have higher costs, and this is how it works. For the Key Advantage 250 and Key Advantage 500 plans, you'll have a separate and higher out of network deductible. For the high deductible health plan, remember you'll have a combined deductible for in and out of network services. For all three plans, you'll have a separate and higher out of network coinsurance after the deductible has been met. For all three plans, you'll have a separate and higher out of network out of pocket maximum. You can rest assured with 95% of the doctors and 96% of the hospitals participating in the blue card PPO network you should not have to use out-of-network providers very often, if at all. Next slide, please. So your benefits include coverage for behavioral health and employee assistance. For inpatient treatment on the Key Advantage 250 plan, facility services have a $400 copayment. On the Key Advantage 500 and the High Deductible Health Plan, facility services have a 20% coinsurance after you meet the deductible. Professional provider services are no cost on the Key Advantage 250 and Key Advantage 500 plans. And on the high deductible health plan, they're 20% coinsurance after meeting the deductible. For outpatient provider visits on the Key Advantage 250 plan, there's a $20 copayment. And on the Key Advantage 500 plan, there's a $25 copayment. On the high deductible health plan, you'll hear me say this over and over again, visits are 20% coinsurance after the deductible has been met. For Employee Assistance Program, also referred to as EAP, you're allowed up to four visits per incident per person per year at no cost to you on all plans. The next slide, please. The Employee Assistance Program provides confidential access to the resources that make a difference. You, your covered dependents, and any members of your household have unlimited 24-7 toll-free call center access. You've got four free in-person counseling sessions per issue, per person, per plan year, so you can use the program for multiple reasons. You can learn more about your EAP services and resources by calling 1-855-223-9277, or you can visit online at www.anthemeap.com. Enter Commonwealth of Virginia as the company name and then select the local choice. Next slide, please. These are a few of the many topics that you can turn to your EAP for information and resources about. Marriage and relationship concerns, health and wellness, finance, legal research, excuse me, legal services, mental health, daily life, and smoking cessation. Next slide, please. Life Health Online lets you have face-to-face -face doctor visits from your smartphone, mobile device, or computer with a webcam at no cost for the Key Advantage 250 and Key Advantage 500 plans. The cost share will mirror your cost share for similar in-person services for the high deductible health plan until the deductible has been satisfied. You can go to lifehealthonline.com or download the apps so you're ready whenever you need the services. Most frequently used, which we like to emphasize, are the Live Health Online Medical, where you can use your device to see a board-certified doctor in minutes, anytime, day or night. It's a fast and easy way to get care for common medical conditions like the flu, colds, allergies, pink eye, sinus infections, and more. 
Life Health Online EAP. You can also access your four free EAP counseling sessions from your device through Life Health Online. Contact your EAP for more to learn more about these services. And you can also use Life Health Online for psychology, psychiatry, and the new Life Health Online Healthy Sleep that I mentioned earlier. Next slide, please. So let's talk about your routine vision benefits. Next slide, please. Your routine vision benefits are available once every planned year. The Blueview Vision Network has 33,000 providers, including independent optometrists with popular retail locations like Lens Crafters and Pearl Vision, and online retail sites like 1-800-CONTACTS and Glasses.com. The routine vision exam copayment on the Key Advantage 250 plan is $35, on the Key Advantage 500, it's $40, and on the high deductible health plan, it's $15. This is the only one exception to that no copayment rule on the high deductible health plan. Your routine vision does have a $15 copay. Next slide, please. In addition to the routine annual eye exam, you'll have the option of using your routine vision benefits for frames or contact lenses. You'll have a $100 allowance towards frames and a 20% discount after the allowance based on the retail cost. You can also receive additional discounts beyond your allowance for an extra pair of glasses and accessories. You'll have a $20 copayment for basic plastic single vision, bifocal or trifocal lenses, and lens enhancements have a separate copayment discount depending on what you need. Next slide, please. You can use your Blue View Vision benefit for contact lenses in lieu of eyeglasses. In addition to the routine eye exam copayment, you'll have a $55 copay for standard fitting and a 10% discount for premium fitting. The standard allowance for conventional lenses is $100, then 15% off the remaining balance. For disposable lenses, it's $100 with no additional discount. And then for non-elective, which are the medically necessary lenses, there's a $250 allowance. You can take advantage of discounts beyond your allowance for accessories and LASIK vision correction. Next slide, please. So pharmacy is the most widely used benefit accessed three times more than the medical benefits. Let's review how your pharmacy benefits work. For outpatient prescription drugs on the Key Advantage 250 and Key Advantage 500 plans, they are subject to a copayment based on the tier the medication falls under. Diabetic supplies are 20% coinsurance, not subject to the deductible. So for up to a 34-day supply of medications, they're usually filled at a local retail pharmacy. Tier 1s, which are typically generics and the lower cost drugs, have a $10 copayment. Tier two, which are typically moderate in cost, have alternatives available, have a $30 copay. Tier three, which are typically more expensive, usually brand name without alternatives, have a $45 copay. And tier four, which are typically the most expensive and specialty related medications, have a $55 copay. For up to a 90 day supply, maintenance medications are filled through the home delivery program, which I'll explain on the next slide. Tier one is a $20 copay. Tier two is a $60 copay. Tier three is a $90 copay. And tier four is $110. Outpatient prescription drugs and diabetic supplies under the high deductible health plan are 20% coinsurance after the deductible. Next slide, please. So if you take daily maintenance medications, for example, a pill for blood pressure or for cholesterol, You'll save money by using the home delivery program. You'll receive a three month supply of your medication with free standard shipping and pay only two copayments. You'll also enjoy the convenience of having the medication delivered right to your home without having to go to the pharmacy every month for your refills. Your doctor can help you get started by writing your prescription for a 90 day supply and contacting Ingenio RX to get you signed up. If you decide to enroll, make sure you have enough of your current medication to cover you while your account is being set up. Orders typically arrive within 14 days of the date the order is received. Next slide, please. To be your healthy best, your benefit plans include access to several health and wellness programs to help you manage your issues. 
The Sydney Mobile app acts like a personal health guide, answering your questions and connecting you to the right resources at the right time. You can use the chat bot to get answers quickly. Download from the App Store for um, Apple or Google Play if you have an Android. You can find care, you can check costs, you can view and use the digital ID cards, you can check all of your benefits and view all of your claims. You can also learn more about the 24 seven nurse line, condition care and future moms. Next slide, please. As a member, you have several health and wellness programs available to you and at no cost to you. Condition care provides support for asthma, diabetes, heart failure, coronary artery disease, and chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, which is COPD. Future Moms, you can access a nurse coach and the maternity support specifically designed to help women have healthy pregnancies and healthy babies. It's important to note, the hospital co-payment is waived on the Key Advantage 250 plan and only the Key Advantage 250 plan if the member enrolls in the Future Moms prenatal program within the first 16 weeks of pregnancy has a dental cleaning during pregnancy and satisfactorily completes the entire program. 24 seven nurse line and audio health tape library. Sometimes you need to have health questions answered right away, even in the middle of the night. You can call 24 seven to speak with the nurse or use the audio health library if you want to learn about a health topic on your own. Your call is always free and completely confidential. Next slide, please. So your benefit plan includes access to personalized benefit um, and plan guidance via the Anthem Health Guide. A team of care professionals can connect you to a host of free and confidential health and wellness programs to help guide you in managing your health issues. Conveniently talk via phone call, chat session, email, or schedule a call back through your computer or mobile device. The Anthem Health Guide can identify gaps in care, for example, if you've missed an annual physical and help you schedule an appointment. They can help you find the right provider and recommend coaching and care plans based on your health conditions. Next slide, please. You can see more information on your benefit plans by registering on the member portal at www.anthem.com forward slash TLC. Take the time to review all the programs and tools available to you so you can get the most out of your benefits. Next slide, please. Before I start into the Delta Dental program, Leanne, were there, or excuse me, Lori Ann, were there any questions in chat or anything that I can answer for anyone before we continue on with dental? So there's one question in the chat. It says, um, how do I go about putting money into the HSA? I'm guessing that'll be one of the forms I feel I missed somehow when I became a new employee in, in August. Okay, so I will answer that question. For the HSA, um, I automatically set that up for you. And yes, there is a form. Um, if you send me an email, I can send it to you. Um, you're, not, you're not bound by starting it doing open enrollment if you're already in a high deductible plan. Um, but yes, and you can change it during open enrollment, so it'll be effective with the new plan year. So we wanna keep, make sure you stay within the annual limits, but you will get that form from me, just send me an email and I'll be happy to send you the form. I try to catch everybody, I apologize if I missed you and didn't send you a form to, um, to add to your HSA, but the employer contributes and employee can contribute to the HSA. Um, and I will distinguish, do this, distinguish a difference when I talk about the FSA a little later. All right, so going back to sharing the screen. Okay. Thank you, ma'am. If we can have um, the next slide, please. It's important to review your dental benefits each year and make sure that you're enrolled in the right plan based on your changing needs, much like the medical plans. Delta Dental offers two plan options, the full comprehensive plan and the preventive only plan, allowing you to select the one that best meets your needs. Next slide, please. The preventive dental option is designed to provide routine preventive care to maintain a healthy smile. There's no plan year deductible and no plan year maximum. You'll receive 100% coverage for diagnostic and preventive services for things such as two cleanings and two exams, 
bite wing and full mouth x-rays, two fluoride treatments for dependents under 19, and sealants for dependents under 19. This plan does not include coverage for primary, major, or orthodontic services. It truly is a preventive only dental benefit. Next slide, please. The comprehensive dental option is designed to provide the routine diagnostic and preventive coverage, as well as the primary, major, and orthodontic services. There's a $25 individual and $75 family plan deductible, which does not apply to the diagnostic and preventive services. There's a $1,500 individual plan year maximum, which also does not apply to the diagnostic and preventive services. There's a separate $1,500 individual lifetime orthodontic maximum. And you'll receive the following coverage under the comprehensive dental option. 100% coverage for preventive and diagnostic services, 80% coverage for primary services, and 50% coverage for major services and orthodontia. Next slide, please. So this slide basically just takes everything I've said and puts it nice and neatly into a side-by-side -side comparison. If you're like me, it helps to see it visually to understand what's covered on one, what's covered or not covered on the other one. Next slide, please. So visit www.deltadentalva.com and register to access your Delta Dental benefits, find a dentist, check claim status, look up average charges for procedures, download forms, and chat with a customer service representative. It is very important to make sure that you have VA in the website address so you're accessing the right providers and information for your plan. Next slide, please. You can also download the Delta Dental mobile app to access the same information right from your mobile device. Next slide, please. So be sure to take advantage of the many tools that Anthem and Delta Dental offer to help you get the most out of your plan. Whether you have a question about your coverage, need a new ID card, or just want to, to find a new provider, Anthem is available by calling 1-800-552-2682 or visit www.anthem.com forward slash TLC. Delta Dental is also available by calling 1-888-335-8296, or you can visit them at www.deltadentalva.com. <laughs> Next slide, please. <laughs> That's all that I had for you today. So thank you so much for your time and attention and for being part of the Local Choice family. Thank you. Thank you, Gabriella. Thank you so much for that presentation. It's a lot of information. And as this is recorded, people can go back and review anything that they um, missed before or if they need to listen to next uh, over again. So next I'm gonna talk about the standalone dental. As Gabriella just discussed, um, we have the dental as a part of the health insurance, and it is an umbrella type program. Um, that's how I refer to it. So you can't take the dental out or take the vision out or, or take um, the EAP out, for example. However, if you need just dental coverage, you do not need to have the health insurance. Maybe you have it through TRICARE or you have it from some other um, provider, then you just need dental. You will need to waive your health insurance coverage you will need to waive the coverage and then go ahead and fill out the form for dental. And if I don't receive the dental form, um, excuse me, the waived health insurance form, I will ask for it. So let's go here. I believe is where I need to go. And we will, so the, the Delta Dental, pardon me, stand alone. So I'm gonna move this down. So the standalone plan, oh, that's not where, here we go. So there are no plan changes for 2021-2022 for Delta Dental, for the standalone plan. The rates are available or will be available on WJCC website as I showed you earlier in the presentation, June 1. All of the documents that you will need to enroll in the Delta Dental Plan and to waive the health insurance because you don't need that if you're going to enroll in this plan um, are also on the website as I showed you earlier. The Delta Dental Standalone Plan 
is a PPO plus premier plan. And any changes or any, um, if you're rolling for the first time, will be effective October 1, which is the beginning of our plan year. Our plan year is October 1 to September 30th, just as it is with the health insurance. So I think I have October 1, 2022, that's an error. It will be effective October 1, 2021. Okay, so that is a typographical error. I apologize for that. Um, the dental plan as stated here, October 1, 2021 through September 30th, 2022. Just a little bit of side-by-side -side information that you can see the deductible amounts for diagnostic and preventive um, and your copay, basic services, endodontic, periodontic care cost, major services cost, and then there is orthodontia and which you cannot see because I've moved the screen here, is here. So your lifetime maximum for orthodontia uh, with this plan, the standalone plan, which again is different than the plan that's with the health insurance is $1,250. The annual maximum is also $1,250, two separate amounts. One does not affect the other. Okay, so you just wanted to, that information again, available online, the plan summary information, all the other detailed information will be available um, in the WJC Connect that I showed you earlier in the presentation. The rates, full-time and part-time rates will be available June 1 in that place that I talked about. Um, you'll be able to access them there. And we do not have them um, right now. I just talked to the Delta Dental representative this morning and they're gonna get those to us by the end of the week. Okay. And I'm gonna stop sharing and see if there are any questions in the chat at this time. I didn't think I related to the dental standalone plan and there are none. Great, so we are gonna move on. And at this time I, earlier, I introduced you to Cindy She's with Legal Resources. And Cindy, I'm gonna go ahead and pull up your presentation so you can start your um, introduction. Wonderful, thank you, Lorianne. Sure. Hello, everyone. As Lorianne said, I'm Cindy Kalasinski with Legal Resources. I'm your account manager and Lorianne's day-to-day -day contact. Yes. And thank you so That's much it. for having me here today. So okay. I know I opened it, so let's just see if we can find it. You were close. Yeah, there it is. So get back out of here. I opened it so that it would be available when I got ready to share screens, but things don't always work as you hope they will. Let's I completely that's understand. <laughs> that's the Delta <laughs> Dental one. It's in that one. Let's end that. Oh, I don't want to get out of Zoom. I don't want to leave you guys there. There you are. Had too much stuff open. <laughs> there we go. I don't see it yet. Oh, okay. I still see the Delta Dental standalone plan. Okay, well, let's stop. You see it now? Now I do. Yes, perfect, great, there we go, good job. Technology is great when it works. <laughs> All right, so I wanna tell you a little bit about legal resources. Legal resources is designed to protect you and your family from the high cost of legal fees. And our company was started in 1990, so over about 30 years ago. And we were founded in Virginia Beach and we're still headquartered there. So your backup and support is just, just down uh, 64. So um, we now are a national company. We have over 12,000 attorneys from coast to coast. Uh, but to your benefit, we uh, have uh, local law firms right around the corner from uh, in the Hampton Roads up through Williamsburg and the Richmond area. Okay, next slide, please. So, as I said, we're designed to protect you from the high cost of legal fees. And the number one thing that I hear on a regular basis is, I'm not in trouble. I don't need a legal plan. However, 70% of all Americans have a legal plan, whether have a legal need, whether it is an expected legal need, like maybe you know you need to get your will prepared, or you need some power of attorneys for your parents, or you're gonna buy a home, or even like refinance your home. That's one of the hot things to do to 
this year, or those unexpected legal needs, like maybe you get a traffic ticket or um, you have a dispute with your landlord. So this is designed to protect you for all of these needs that you see here that go on in your everyday life throughout the ages of your life. So next slide, please, Laurieann. We'll go through the coverage. So the legal plan works a little bit like your medical and dental in that you get a local provider, you call them directly anytime you have a legal need. And on the left-hand side, that's what we consider our fully covered services. That's our fully covered attorney's time. So these are listed in detail. You can use the plan as often as you like. You consultation advice, will preparation, review of documents. We even have some things like uncontested divorce and adoption, uh, real estate, civil actions, identity theft education. So this is about 90% of what most people need in their daily lives. And what we cover is the attorney's time. If you have a court cost or a filing fee, that would be your responsibility as a member. So we cover the attorney's time and attorneys in the area range about $300 an hour. And this benefit is for you and your family for just a couple hundred dollars for the year in payroll deductions. So we're gonna use traffic violations as an example. Say your teenager gets a traffic ticket and you definitely wanna to go to court so that you don't get any, uh, anything on your, their driver's license or your insurance go up. You take out your card, call legal resources attorney and that attorney would go to court with you. You, hopefully your teenager will get out of the, the traffic ticket, but if they don't, you will be responsible for that court cost you pay zero for that attorney to go to court with you. So that's a great example of an unexpected legal need. And then will preparation, which is my little soapbox that I have to say, uh, will preparation, power of attorneys, medical directive. If you went outside the plan, wills can cost about $900. Um, and you get a will for you and your spouse and it would not cost you a thing. Um, if you have an administrative fee, sometimes there's a $25, $50 administrative fee, but you pay zero for that attorney's time. Now, if you have something that's pre-existing or something a little bit more complicated, they're kind of listed on the right there, you still have coverage and you would receive initial consultation advice for free up to an hour and then a 25% savings off the normal charges of the law firm. This can be a huge savings on more complicated issues like uh, divorce, contested divorce, uh, custody and child support, maybe if somebody gets in a little bit more uh, extensive trouble. But 25% off of a $300 an hour is a $75 savings an hour, that savings can add up very quickly. So the big picture of the coverage is we cover all your attorney fees either in full or at a discount. There's only one service that you're not allowed to use the plan for, and that's action against the school system because obviously they're the administrator of the plan. So, okay, moving on to the next slide. Your rate is the same. It has not changed. It's only $17 a month. I'll do the math for you. That's $204 over 12 months in payroll deductions. And that includes you, your spouse, and eligible dependent children up to age 26. Like I said, you can use the plan as often as you like. So if you get that, just get that will prepared or use the plan once every few years, it really pays for itself because there's no additional charge for those dependents. And that $204 obviously is a lot less than $300 an hour for an attorney. So. Uh, Lorraine talked about the little red packet. In the red packet, there's a frequently asked question page, and it tells you how to enroll on our legal resources portal. Basically, you go to legalresources.com, and then you put in your company code, as it shows here, it's 3757, and your password or enrollment password is WJB Legal. So, uh, Lori Ann's going to send out some information that will have the direct link also on your website where you have your benefit information that Lori went to earlier. That also has the direct link. So it'll take you right to legalresources.com and you will not have to put in that uh, company code and password. 
So it's very simple. You just put in your personal information. And in that, once you elect that you want to join a legal plan, there'll be a section that says, um, who's your law firm? Who would you like to elect? There is a link to our website and you can look at all the law firms in your area. You would just put in your zip code and then the different law firms will come up and you choose the law firm, put it in, and then that's the law firm that you will have. If you don't choose a law firm, we will assign one depending on your home zip code. Now, right before open enrollment, I mean, right before your effective date, which is October, you'll get a card in the mail and a welcome packet. That card will have the law firm's name and number, and you call that attorney for any legal needs at all, whether it be just a question or that traffic ticket, um, anything. Um, make sure you know that anything except action against your employer. Many people forget that they have a legal plan. They may ask a friend about advice or even a husband about advice, but that's what you have a legal plan for is to ask an attorney. You can ask them as many questions as you like, and you know I'll say it over and over again, but use the plan as often as you like. Now, Lori, on the next slide, we'll tell you our contact information. And Legal Resources Member Services number is also on your card. Um, the phone number is 1-800-728-5768. Now, this is for member services. They're certified paralegals. They're always your backup and support. So say you um, get that traffic ticket, you call your law firm and they say, I'm sorry, I can't handle that ticket. It's out of our area or even out of the state you would call member services, they'll get you an attorney that can do it with the same coverage. If you don't know who your law firm is or you just get in a panic, always call member services. They actually have won awards for the past eight years for frontline customer service and they're there to assist you. Ultimately, sometimes the attorney has to quote the coverage because things change in the legal world, but they're always there as your liaison. So. You can find additional information on our website, www.legalresources.com. There's also a wonderful like three minute video about the legal plan. So I encourage you to go on the website um, to watch the video, check out the law firms. Um, and there's an array of other things that you can do on there as well. So no rate changes and no plan changes. That's wonderful for your new year. And if you have any questions before or before joining or during member, you can call member services. So thank you so much, Lori Ann. Thank you. We do have a question. Wonderful. Um, and it says, um, I signed up le using legal resources with my prior employer. Mm -hmm. um, and not sure. Let's see, I have not gone. She has not changed where she worked. Not sure if she has to do that. Um, I still have a $17 deducted from my account each month. Do I need to redo anything um, being that I changed employers? Well, you definitely, because the payroll deduction is with your, should be with your current employer. So I would just call member services and have them check you in the system. Um, however, you should be having that payroll deduction from your current employer. So it's the payroll deduction, um, uh, Lindsay, if you don't mind, the, the payroll deduction it, deduction is coming directly out of your account because if that's the case, we want to stop that so that you can start coming directly from WJCC. Cindy, how should she do, how should she manage that? First, I would just call member services, have them look her up in the system, see okay. which account that she is under, um, and then we can go from there. Okay. <clears throat> if okay. you would, and if, if she would like my email address, she can also email me. I can look okay. things up for her. I'll go ahead and put that in the chat box. Okay. Thank um, you. Yeah. Thank you. And thank you for the question. That was an awesome question. I would never have thought of that. That was great. And my, it's going in right now. Okay. Thank you. So, so member services are wonderful because they can get to all the back end information. Perfect. Here's my K L S I N S K Y. Okay, perfect. So grab that and also have Cindy's information also here in the office. 
Thank you so much for sharing. And we have one final thing we're gonna talk about before I'll let you all go and open up for any additional questions. And that is the flexible spending account. Flexible spending account is handled through Flexible Benefit Administrators, which is out of Virginia Beach. You do have to enroll in the flexible spending account every year. It's an annual enrollment. So because you enrolled last year and you decided a certain amount, it, um, then you have to do it again this year. It doesn't just roll over. It is, if you're not familiar, pre-tax dollars that you can set aside for medical expenses or for dependent care. Um, uh, and those monies are yours to use for medical expenses, as I said, and there's a whole list of items that you can use it for. The, where I showed you earlier, the various documents, there's an employee handbook or guide from FSA that's there, and you can see all the things that are listed that you can use your medical um, funds for. There's also information on the dependent care, who's eligible for the dependent care, um, the annual maximum amounts, and all that information is in that booklet. You will need to use the portal um, to do that. So the um, information that you will receive, that red cover sheet that I mentioned earlier, it has information from flexible benefit administrators on how to enroll online. If you've not enrolled before, you would have to create an account with a username and password. If you have, then you just go in using your username and password following the instructions. And of course, there's the also for legal resources. And you can go, go go to WJCC Connect, see these items or these documents as well, and there are hot links in there for you to use also. So before we end the recording for the day, are there any questions from any of our participants in the chat? Let's see, anything else? And if not, now that we're at the end, if anybody just wants to unmute themselves to ask a question, you're welcome to do that as well. No? You all have been great. John, any closing remarks from you? Just thank you to our guest speakers and to you, Laurieann, for putting this together. It'll be a valuable online tool for folks during open enrollment. Thank you so much. Again, thank you, um, Gabriella. Thank you, Cindy. Thank you to our three employees who joined us um, so much. We appreciate you being here and asking questions that others may have um, not thought to ask or would think to ask as they're watching this video. Again, I'm going to 